Matchbox. Fallon's in the court. Good. We're here today to try John McGuilty. Mr. McGuilty, you are accused of kidnapping and torturing the well-known model Francis McGale and then robbing him of five dollars and a Los Angeles Lakers key ring. Are you the model? Yes, that's me, Your Honor. What kind of model? A hand model, Your Honor. Very well, Mr. Prosecutor. You may proceed to cross-examine the accused. Confess, you bastard. It was you who murdered him, wasn't it? Just admit it, we can put an end to this farce and go home. Uh, objection, Your Honor. I believe the question goes beyond the facts and evidence. Objection sustained. Mr. Prosecutor, ask fewer questions and hit him harder. Um, objection, Your Honor. Now, what is it now? The prosecution does not seem to be wearing the regulation gloves. Objection sustained. Does the prosecution have anything else to add? Yes, Mr. McGuilty. You kidnapped and tortured Mr. McHale to steal five dollars in a Los Angeles Lakers key ring. Do you have an alibi? I'm not a Lakers fan. My team's the Chicago Bulls. We have eyewitnesses who claim to have seen you enter a room in the motel with McHale who was wearing a gag. Mm, that's a lie. I gagged him when we got inside. In that case, can you explain to the jury why McHale was found handcuffed to one of the legs of the bed? I was demonstrating a magic trick. In the nude? Yeah, I thought it was weird too. He said he was feeling kind of hot. And how do you explain these photos, which were taken by a Japanese tourist, who for reasons that do not concern us here, was also in the room at the time? This photo clearly shows you handcuffing Mikhail to the bed. And in this photo, you appear to be smiling, with five dollars in one hand, the Lakers key ring in the other, and Mr. Mikhail hanging upside down in the background. What do you have to say about these photos? Hmm, I think they're both a little out of focus. Well, I think I'm ready to pronounce sentence. So let's bring on the Wheel of Fortune. And the sentence is... Oh, <laughs> we've got to give it another spin. <laughs> My word, and the complaint that the justice system doesn't give people a second chance. <laughs>